It is a Corn Jam Thursday brought to you by Hoosier E-Cig and our good friend Don Elbreg is back. Good morning, sir. Good morning. I'm always so nervous I'm going to say your last name wrong. No, you're good. I nailed it, or I nailed it though, right? You did. You Elbrick. Got it. All right, yep. perfect. Uh, he's been in here. Is this your third time now? I believe so. Yeah. Uh, and you also performed for us uh, at Freedom Jam. That and, was a blast. Uh, you know, that was so much fun out there at uh, Craig Park for our big Fourth of July get down with Greenwood Parks and Rec. Mm-hmm. Uh, Don is a. I guess we can officially say he's a friend of the show now, right? Yes. Okay. Well, I'm honored. <laughs> uh, you're also uh, out of. Uh, you're out of work right now. Oh no! <laughs> I worded that bad, huh? No, no, it's true because, you know, I'm on break. So. <laughs> uh, you are a teacher. You're on winter break. So you thought, hey, let me come in and play some songs for you guys. And we appreciate that. Oh, what, pre- what have you been up to since the last time you were here? Well, you know, just uh, just working on uh, putting out some individual uh, free downloads, things like that. Of course, we've got four boys, so they keep us plenty busy. Uh, oh, yeah. Uh, two older boys are playing basketball right now. So that's been fun. How was your uh, Christmas it yesterday? Was, it was great. Thanks. It was you know, it was busy and it was fun, and uh, our two younger boys are uh, three and six, so they really are really into it, which yeah. is really fun. Some of the fun years oh, right there. Yeah. Mm-hmm. yeah. Uh, awesome. Well, uh, you did mention uh, working on some uh, different singles and things like that. Now, you had a song that you performed all the way back in 1999, correct? That's correct. Well, it was called Travel and Shoes? Yes, sir. Yeah. And you performed that for your, was it, what was it? You said it was a special occasion, right? It was. It was my dad's. It was a surprise uh, 56th birthday party for my dad two days after his actual birthday, so he really didn't have a clue. Which was great. Perfect. That's, that's what we were hoping for. Uh, well, you recently kind of re-released that. Uh, it's a four-part harmony gospel acapella song. People can find that if they want to listen to that or find it. Where can they find it at? Uh, it's at cdbaby.com. The actual, I mean, you could just go there and search Don Elbrick, but uh, store.cdbaby. Um, slash Don Elbrick. All right. Well, that's kind of his latest project. You can also find CDs, downloads uh, at DonElbrick.com. Of course, you can find him on Facebook as well. Everybody has a Facebook. Just search Don Elbrick Music and anywhere you can get your uh, your download your music. He's there as well. Uh, Well, without any further ado, we want to hear some music from you. What are you going to play for us first? Uh, This is a a song. I'm not sure who originally wrote it, but um, Junior Brown... um, He's actually he's from Kirksville, Indiana, which is down by Trafalgar, not far from Trafalgar. Oh, okay, and um, near Johnson County here. Yes, sir. Yep, you got it. And he uh, he he plays that um, what that instrument he invented called the git steel. He's got like a, a six string uh, electric on top, but connected to it is a, a a like would be a lap steel, and he he toggles between the two live. I mean, it's amazing how he does it. Wow. And, and speaking of that. Um, I guess it's not been too long ago that he and you know he they were, I think they were somewhere in, I'm not sure exactly where somewhere up north, but his he and his wife's guitars got stolen out of their car. Oh no! Yeah, and uh, and thieves. That's right. <laughs> and actually, uh, I guess they they still haven't found them, and they put out a, uh, a like a three thousand dollar reward for these guitars. I mean, one of them is one of his good steals that he, you know, that he had built and. Uh, I still haven't found it. I mean, I don't know who could get away with, you know, trying to resell it because it's, I mean, it's it's his thing, you know. Right, right. So well, we uh, better get Sheriff Burgess or uh, Chief Cochran on, mm-hmm. on, on the case. <laughs> they tend to solve all their cases. But he's uh, he, he's great. Uh, I've seen him. He plays a lot down at the Bluebird in Bloomington. And uh, he's actually been at the Vogue before in Broad Ripple. So. Very cool. Well, what's the name of the song? It's, uh, it's called Too Many Nights in a Roadhouse. All right. Too Many Nights in a Roadhouse by Don Elbreg right now on a corn jam on Corn Country 100.3. Too many nights in a roadhouse, too much wine, women and song. But too many days on the highway and a run around all night long. I take a good look in the mirror in the cold gray light of dawn. But too many nights in an old roadhouse, run a little good boy wrong. Hanging with my buddies on the wild sides caused me to run a bad luck. I out all night with that roadhouse crowd, now I'm down to my last two bucks. Pushing way too hard, trying to live too fast, putting too many wrinkles on. Too many nights in an old roadhouse, run a little good boy wrong. Too many nights in a roadhouse, too much wine, women, and song. But too many days on the highway and I run around all night long. I take a good look in the mirror in the cold gray light of dawn. But too many nights in an old roadhouse, I run a little good boy wrong. 
When too many nights in a roadhouse, too much wine, women song. On too many days on the highway and I run around all night long. I take a good look in the mirror in the cold gray light of dawn. On too many nights in an old road house, I run a little good boy wrong. It was some kind of life I was living, and it didn't take long to tell That the blues come around when the sun went down, and my days didn't fare too well I sure did want a taste of the good life, until the good times come along When too many nights in an old road house run a little good boy wrong When too many nights in a road house, too much wine, women and song on too many days on the highway, now I run around all night long. I take a good look in the mirror in the cold gray light of dawn. On too many nights in an old road house, I run a little good boy wrong. On too many nights in an old road house, I run a little good boy wrong. All right, that was Don Elbrag on a Corn Jam brought to you by Hoosier E-Sig. Each and every Thursday, we play some live music from artists, both locally and, you know, sometimes they come up from Nashville or mm -hmm. wherever. Uh, just a fun time of live music here every Thursday morning. Uh, our guest today didn't have to travel too far, Don Elbreg. Uh, if you want to keep up with where he's playing and when, you can go to donelbreg.com. You can also follow him on Facebook. Just search Don Elbreg Music. That's E-L-B-R-E-G. Uh, Don, thanks for stopping in today. Thanks again so much for having me. I appreciate it. No problem. Uh, again, he already played one song for us. Played a cover just a little bit ago. To me, it sounded like it wasn't Johnny Cash, but to me, it had that Johnny Cash vibe. It definitely did. It did. It did, for it sure. Did. Uh, and he wants to play an original for us uh, for his second song. What's what's the story behind this one? What's this one called? Well, I uh, I grew up riding showing horses. Um, of course, thanks to my dad. Uh, he was big into that as well as my mom years ago. And, uh, you know, we my my godparents' son, Garrett, I was going to say he's my godbrother, uh, he and I would ride, you know, up and down the fields. And then when we'd go trail riding as a family, we'd go down through like south you know we southwest way park and then go through all these different cornfields before we got into the woods and you know for trail riding and stuff like that and uh of course as i'm sure most songwriters are i really love you know big into alliteration yeah so you know it's uh, you know a lot of hard c sounds in this song and you know um uh, that's that's what was inspired it and it's funny i don't know why i haven't played it on here before because it's actually called cornfield huh. I, don't, I don't know why <laughs> not with not with a k but hey, you're playing but it now though this is true this is true better late than never that's the, yes that one is. of my uh favorite things about don is he's he's a storyteller mm -hmm. a lot of people a lot of artists you know they'll they'll just play the song he tells you kind of the meaning behind it uh so this one it kind of growing up around horses and being on the trails and everything what's the name of it again cornfield cornfield why can't i remember that come on <laughs> Uh, well, without further ado, Don, let's hear it. It's called Cornfield by Don Elbreg on a corn jam on Corn Country 100.3. In a cool, quiet corner of a cornfield That's where as a child I'd often like to hide Where I'd dream away the day And safely tucked away Surrounded by tall corn stalks far and wide Riding down the rows of corn With my foes not far behind Running from the dangers that I'd conjured in my mind no matter how far-fetched each feud, all fantastically construed Somehow I'd always manage to survive In that cool, quiet corner of a cornfield Where as a child I'd often like to hide Where I'd dream away the day, and safely tucked away Surrounded by tall corn stalks far and wide 
Whether fleeing from an Indian band drawing nibbles back Or outlaws clad from head to toe in black Well, good always prevailed and the gangs wound up in jail And I'd do it all again with each new sunrise In that cool, quiet corner of a cornfield Where as a child I'd often like to hide Where I'd dream away the day I'm safely tucked away Surrounded by tall corn stars far and wide No playground snatched the marvel of that cornstalk covered ground And to this day it seems one has yet to be found well, Each year I dread the day the corn were harvested and called away When it finally came tears welled within my eyes Where that cool quiet corner of a cornfield Where as a child I'd often like to hide Where I'd dream away the day Safely tucked away Surrounded by tall corn stocks far and wide Surrounded by tall corn stocks far and wide Surrounded by tall corn stocks far and wide all right, that's Don Elbreg on a corn jam brought to you by Hoosier e Sig. I'm out of breath just watching him perform that song. <laughs> uh, you guys can't see it at home, but luckily our uh, good friend David, our videographer here, gets a video up of each of our corn jam guests. Uh, corncountry.com. It'll also be posted on our social media pages if you search Corn Country 1003. You will see that while he was playing that song, uh, in between singing, he was obviously, obviously, obviously playing the harmonica. I don't know why. I said that three times. Obviously. Uh, obviously. Uh, but literally, like, what's that contraption called? I mean, uh, you know, I honestly don't know what, what it's called. You just, like, wrap it around your neck, and it holds the harmonica in place. Yeah, I, I guess maybe just... Um, harmonica har- holder. Maybe that's yeah, that could be it. <laughs> I'm going to call it H squared. That's good.